Ready, Ryan. So we're looking at the property at 16722 County Road 827 in Pearland, Texas. As we can see, right immediately, it's in a flood zone. And this home here is 228800 square feet. And it was built in 1997. And uh, it was the lot size is over 174,240 square feet. Uh, now, this was extremely challenging, man, because in the zip, in the subdivision where it's located, which is AT, HT and BRR, there is absolutely no comps I could use just due to the age of the home and the size of the land that it sits on. Now, we have one property here that's been on the market for a very long time at 650. Uh, obviously, the home has um, it's a lot bigger and the land is bigger as well. So market for approximately 393 days uh the lot size the home is over 3,000 square feet built in 1991 and the lot size is over 217,000 square feet so if we go to the pending there is really nothing in the subdivision that i can really select from all the lot sizes are extremely small compared to what you have uh and uh the homes are are newer compared to to what you have right 2005 17 18 2006 so i went to the sold comps right and uh there was only two that i could somewhat use um this subdivision here is about half a mile away from this home uh the lot the home size is 2142 the lot size is smaller uh and this one sold at 212,500. and if we can go ahead and take a look at it here uh, it's pretty original from the inside your average, you know, country home in this area, ranch style. So nothing that's been updated. Again, I don't know how this other home looks like that you're going to be uh, possibly looking at. But uh, it was on the market for 84 days. It started at 249.9, uh, and it ended up selling at 230. Uh, I do not know. Uh, it went conventional. So it, it, as a matter of fact, it even sold for less. It went for 212500 and it sold last year uh within the last six months but nothing uh nothing solid man as far as a more recent comp we have this one on, on uh, heritage road which is in the same subdivision again the lot size is smaller and so is the house built in 1983 it's a 225 uh thousand this one ended up selling give me just a second i mean this one's a really cool log house And uh, it was at 216, 750, five days on the market, and it ended up selling for 225. So it got more than uh, what they wanted for, right? And it went conventional. So I looked at that, and then the last one was here. This was on West Lee. This one sold at 285 at $164 a square foot. Uh, again, it's a 3-2. Uh, this one here is uh, 17, over 1,700 square feet. Again, the lot size is really small compared to yours. But this was the nearest subdivision that uh, looked comparable to this one. Uh, just because you'll be able to see right now on Google Maps if this one was fixed up nice. Uh, again, I'm assuming you're probably going to have to get your appraiser to look at it. I don't know if he's going to have to go outwards some i went out a mile uh just to see if i can get some comps and uh I, I really struggled so i understand this home is at 1732 your home is obviously larger they got 164 49 and me just being conservative even at 150 dollars a square foot due to the fact that you got bigger land and a, and a bigger home uh i'm i'm coming up with a price of 343 200 Again, take that with a grain of salt because there's just nothing to go off of. If this home would have sold at 650, it could possibly make some sense as this home is smaller, both home wise and lot size wise. Uh, but again, I, there's really nothing much to go on. And as you can see, I, I assume that this is the home here. I pulled it up on Google Maps. Uh, and I really can't see any other home. All other homes kind of do look older. This one uh, does look a bit newer. Uh, so, man, I hope this helps, but like I said, I, I would really urge you to get your, your appraiser to look at it because there's just really no comps to go off of in this area. So I hope this helps, man. I hope this kind of can gauge it somewhat, but, you know, there's really just nothing uh, nothing to go off of.
So, alrighty, man. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.